Hey, what's up, everybody? Let's get right into this deep dive, guys. Um, tonight was an interesting night on the uh, marketplace. I've got some questions for you guys, and I hope uh, to get a lot of comments on what you guys think. Let's get right into it. Bottom line, I like these Antonov World Cargo liveries, but I already have another one uh, hearted, and uh, I think they're cool, but I've got, I've got the other one, and I think the other one uh, is a little better. I haven't bought it yet, but I'll have to compare those. I'd like everybody's opinion on the B206 flying, flying side, whatever it is, Incorporated. I don't know much about that. I think I heard a bad rumor months and months ago. Um, but please let me know if you guys like that and if that's good. 767 is what it is, guys. I do like those, but I have uh, two already. Again, I do like the, the, the aircraft, and I'm one of the only ones that like it, and that's fine. Uh, let's move down to what I feel is relevant, guys, tonight. I was really, I thought this was really funny to see an F-35 by M scenery. I honestly thought that was funny, guys. I, I usually don't even think any of it. That's just funny to me. Uh, moving on. Let's see. I'm really interested in Idaho backcountry, guys. It looks really, really cool. O ORBX usually works pretty good for me. Please let me know in the comments below if you got this, but I'm really interested in that. Matter of fact, I'm going to heart that one right now. Um, I want to really want to get, especially with the uh, Got Friends Legacy Pack, I really would like to get out there and fly some uh, good sorties out there. Um, none of this stuff, uh, this Kodiak 100 Legacy Pack, I've already bought it. I just recently bought a really awesome um, uh, livery pack for the Kodiak, so I probably won't get in this. I don't cover all the airports, guys, because the airports have just been atrocious on, on performance uh, on our game, especially after the last update. Don't get me started. Um, like I said, this one looks cool, but, uh, I'm not going to get too deep into airports tonight. Let me know if you guys bought a specific one. I do want to talk about these regional, uh, water fixes. We've got one for Miami and I believe San Diego tonight and, uh, by dream scenery. It looks really good. I have no idea if it'll perform or cause CTDs. My CTDs and, and, and stuttering have been at an all time high since the recent update a couple days ago. So I'm a little fearful of adding on anything. But uh, please let me know in the comments below. That looks really nice, guys. I like that. Uh, moving on down, we've got real effects for the 747, just like the A320 last week. Guys, I think these look awesome. Uh, they're a tiny bit unrealistic, but I think they're going in the right direction. And uh, I may just buy them. I don't know. I like the way it looks. I haven't been able to fly the 747 in months. It does not fly for me. I get CTDs. I can fly the A320. So uh, those effects look pretty cool, guys. Let me know in the comments below what you think. There's San Diego's Regional Water Coast Improvement. Um, let's talk about these Shorts Regionals. I, I, is that the plane's name, Short Regional? I don't know. But uh, it looks kind of cool. I think this $53 one is all three of these combined. Uh, I don't know that for a fact. But please let me know in the comments below what you think about that, guys. I have to read and see what the features are. I'm not going to jump on that just yet. It's a little costly. But uh, let me know in the comments below. I hope anybody's bought it. You see that one only has one review, but it's a 5 out of 5. So please let me know in the comments below what you think about that. Uh, Cheat River, I'm a fan of Parallel 42, guys. So I'll probably be checking that out. I'm going to go ahead and heart that. I haven't even looked because I like that developer. They never let me down. This F-14 Tomcat by Heat Blur India Fox Echo was... Uh, really a surprise to me tonight guys i'm a huge dc fan and i'm gonna leave it to the review i'm gonna make the review for that after this all i'm gonna say is it's 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 really good man i really like that um miltech simulations um they are they are the, the distributor of the 1980s marine court basically the top gun version of miramar now, guys, I'm up front. I never lie. I'm very transparent, guys. I work directly with Miltech, too, so you know I'm being honest here. That had some performance issues and still does for me right now. And Miltech was going to take that off tonight. I don't know why it's still on there, so I'll have to uh, communicate with them. But uh, we need to work on that a little bit more for performance. If you bought it already, do not panic. We will get it right. Miltech's on it. We're already aware. I've reported all the issues. I had that earlier before anybody else today. And uh, we've had, uh, outside of the performance issues, guys, it's going to be a complete blast. We just need to figure out a way to make it uh, work flawlessly and smoothly on the Xbox. So, right to business, guys. No nonsense. That was my deep dive. Let me know what you guys bought. Let me know what you guys think. I like to hear from the community. Peace.